Hey, what's crack lacking YouTube? This video is gonna be all about a Tuesday night in the life of a teacher and a thrifter. And it's been a day out of Tuesday. Just got home from work, I'm a full-time teacher, and now it's time to start doing my little eBay hustle or the side business, whatever you want to call it. This is going to be a video like I've never done before. Um, basically, I sold four things. I'm going to pull those very briefly, and then I am trying to scale up my eBay store, trying to list every night. My goal is to try to sell two items a day, which is a very small goal. And so far this week, I have met that goal. But hey, set a small goal that you can achieve, and then you got to go big. So two items a day, and you can't sell anything if you don't list anything. So I have like 11 things that I'm going to list, and once I get them listed, I will show them to you guys, and you can see what I'm listing, what I'm selling. You see everything I'm doing here as a part-time reseller, and um, you're gonna love this video. You're, you're gonna love it so much, you're gonna wanna subscribe. No, I'm just kidding, but please make sure to subscribe because I am only one subscriber away from 200 subscribers. And man, I might have to have a cold refreshment if I hit 200 subscribers. Another cold refreshment, because I'm having one right now because it's been a hell of a Tuesday. All right, so first things first, I got some packages to pull. You're not gonna see me package them up, but you will see me pull them. And I got some pretty good sales for a Tuesday as a part-time seller, well, at least in my opinion. I sold a very old pair of buckle jeans. Uh, these used to be mine, and I don't wear them anymore because I'm a professional, and I don't shop at the buckle. $15 plus shipping for these. I sold a Marlboro hat, Marlboro, can't never say that word, but I sold a cigarette hat, pretty cool hat, $14.99 free shipping. For $20 free shipping, I sold a bunch of these little graphic novels, which for little kids reading chapter books. They're brand new sealed, got them at the flea market early summer for super cheap, I think a dollar each, uh, and they sold for 20. And I sold another vintage snap bag. This one's Budweiser. Um, love this. Man, I love selling vintage. Vintage shirts, vintage hats. I love selling everything vintage. This is your daily reminder to buy vintage. All right, those are the four things that I sold while at work today. Now I got to go list some things. I'm trying to take this eBay uh, very seriously, and it does not work unless you list like every night. So I got. I'm looking to put up like 10 more listings tonight. Now remember, I'm a part-time reseller, so 10 listings up a night, four sales a day. Hey, that's awesome for me. Let's take a look at what I have going up for sale. All right, the first thing I have going up for sale are these shoes. Got the upside down all around action. As you can see, they're in pretty decent condition, size seven and a half, and this will be the first thing that I gotta list. All right, the next two things I got going up for sale tonight are this still vintage snapback. I got this from the bins from 1989, and if you take a look, it's on a special K Products snap. So these K Products hats, uh, these vintage snapbacks have really blown up here recently. So this should be a decent sale. I'm happy to list this one. Check out that thread count. And the next one is the Superman hat. It's all leather. It's like the fleather, the fake leather made by Superman himself. Um, this isn't much, but I picked this up from the bins as well, and it's going to be another like $10 sale. So it's only $10, but for me, any sale is a good sale. All right, the next item to go up for sale is this Starbucks mug. Uh, I paid a quarter for this, and it's looking to be like another $10 sale. So hey, remember, any sale is a good sale for me. Maybe not for you, but for me. All right, the next thing I got going up for sale today is this Coca-Cola jacket. This thing is vintage. It is super cool, and it is in pristine condition. Uh, got the nice checkered sleeves and the stripes and everything. Another little Coca-Cola patch right there. Always Coca-Cola. I like this a lot. I posted this up on my Instagram, and nobody wanted it. So now it has to go onto eBay. And I think I'm going to post this up for like 50 bucks plus shipping. The next thing I'm going to list is this keyboard. Um, this was a bad buy. I thought this was gonna be a good seller, and it's not, even though it is still like brand new open box, it's really only going to be like a $15 sale if I'm lucky. But I have it, so I might as well list it and hopefully get it out of here. And that's gonna do it. I'm actually going to list a couple vintage Time Magazine magazines that are out in my garage. I'll get those thrown up on eBay tonight as well. 
And then I think I'm gonna call it good. So, I mean, it is what it is. At least I'm gonna get something posted up for sale. But that is a very, very quick video of what I'm going to do on my Tuesday. If you liked this video, please like it on YouTube. The algorithms are real and the liking actually plays a huge role in it. And I'm only one subscriber away, so like the video, spread some love, get me that one more subscriber before I go to sleep tonight. And the last thing I want to say, guys, hard work pays off, so keep the grind going. If you ever want to take something seriously, hard work's going to be the only thing that makes it happen. So yeah, here's to growing and succeeding as a reseller. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you on the next one.